morning, Sex family. How you guys all doing today? I hope you're having a fantastic day. Got a smile on your face, and you're ready for a brand new video. Yeah, I said I hope you're having a fantastic day because obviously I'm not. The past literally 24 hours have been uh, due to the fact that my iPhone XS Max doesn't work anymore. It's literally in mint condition. The phone is literally a year old, and I did the news iOS update yesterday. And then my phone magically fried. Literally, if you guys don't follow me on my Twitter at Jeff Saxon Vlogs, you would know I was tweeting about the biggest things that kept happening to my phone yesterday. Start with Face ID not working, then it overheated earlier in the day, and then at the end of the day, I was like, you know what? Might as well do that new update. And literally, since the new update, my phone does not turn on. And this is twice it has happened to me in the last 14 months. I'll explain later. But I'm just really frustrated right now because I really rely on my phone a lot. But I want to know down below in the comment section, have you guys ever had an issue with your phone that's like happened to me where you've done an update and it just fully crashed? We just got to the Freehold Mall. It's literally where the closest Apple store is uh, from my house. It's about 40 minutes away compared to the one that's in Cherry Hill, which is like an hour away. But mom... We're actually filming a challenge today too while we're at the mall. You wanna know what we're doing? Anything you can carry, I will buy. <laughs> what? Don't that challenge. Why why is that? Because literally uh, we're not actually doing it due to the fact I got no money in my account to do that at the moment. Honestly, Ma, I just hope they give me a new phone today. Like you think they owe me because I do the update and it just turns my phone off completely. Yeah, put it off your phone? Yeah. Which means Apple. You owe me a new iPhone, preferably the iPhone 11 at this point. The Apple Store. Thank God for Apple Care. Literally just saved me so much money. Several days later. So the last few clips were actually recorded a few days ago. It may seem like about 10 seconds ago you guys were just in that part of the day, but it's crazy how videos work to be honest. So yeah, that was then and this is now. I got an update on the phone, some good news. The new phone works really, really well. Like I said, thank God for Apple Care. If I didn't have that, I would be paying $600 for an iPhone that I got last year, which was over $1,000. I'm like, yo, your update fried my phone. Why do I have to pay so much money if I didn't have Apple Care? So thankfully, I had it. It bailed me out this time, and uh, my new phone works really well. But when you have good news, you always have bad news, and bad news is today, I have to go take my mom to get surgery. She's actually getting surgery done on her hand, and she's like, hey, can you drive me? Because I have to go under anesthesia and all this stuff. And I was like, mom, I got you. Then she's like, yo, you can actually record for a video. And I'm like, Mom, I got you even more. But in all seriousness, she has to get something done on her hand, so if you guys could do me a favor and wish her well down below in the comment section, I would highly appreciate that. Hey Zeus, everybody's been asking about you, Rex and Willow. Zeus, come here. Zeus, let's show them how well you've gotten at like your training. Ready? Zeus, sit. No? Okay. Thanks, Zeus. Thanks for leaving me hanging. Can I have hugs, Willow? Hey, right, thanks for giving me hugs. Seriously, so you, you didn't listen at all to me, okay puppy? You go back and play with Rex. For everyone asking me how the dogs were, uh, there you go. They, they are still dogs and still doing well. You ready for your big day? I mean, well, you have to get surgery, but are you ready? Yep. Which, which hand you get surgery on? Uh, Alright, so what exactly is wrong with your hand? There's a mass in my thumb. Wait, I'm trying to get my camera to focus. What is that? Come on, you got like a hand tumor? It's, oh, whoa, whoa. Mom, what is going on with your hands? They don't know what's in. What's what inside? Is. Yeah. Can you literally, like, this is just a general question, if my camera focuses, could you impossibly get like a tumor in your finger? Yes. What if that was one? It could be, I don't know. Dude, like, are you growing an alien in your head? Did you go to Area 51 without me, Mom? Yeah. You, oh, so that's where you put the alien. Yeah. And now they're going to extract it for you today. I know. I hope to see what it actually looks like when. Yeah. Do you think they'll let me go in there while you like they do it and like I could just film it real quick? No, he's not that cool. <sighs> I'll probably talk to him, guys. I'm gonna do my best, like sweet talk to the doctor. But like, yo, I could get you more customers to get their thumbs cut open if they just want to get their thumb cut open. I don't know why you guys want to get cut open, but yeah, I'm a. Uh... I'm gonna put the camera down. The main reason why I'm taking my mom today is uh, she needed me to drive her home. She can drive there, fine. It's just uh, you're gonna be anesthesia out on the way back. I'm gonna be in a twilight. He said a twilight sleep, so I'm not gonna be completely knocked out. I'll be able to see what they're doing, 
but I probably won't remember it like my other one. Well, let's go take care of business. Speaking of anesthesia and like a twilight sleep, it reminds me of a story back when I had to go under anesthesia. I probably want to say at like eight years at this point. No, yeah, yeah, I was uh, senior year of high school. So basically I had to get a camera sticking down my throat uh, for a thing called an endoscopy. Like my stomach wasn't feeling right for things for like a few weeks. So they stuck a camera down my throat, whatever. I was passed out. I woke back up from this anesthesia. It was like for 15, 30 minutes and guess what? greatest sleep of my life for those who have ever been put under anesthesia or are going to be put under one day uh just letting you know the sleep literally the best sleep you're going to ever get so mom you're about to get the best sleep you will ever get again today so enjoy enjoy your rest I can't like wait. my mom's gonna be like she's gonna come home she's gonna feel rejuvenated be like yeah my thumb only hurts a little but i got some sleep and literally it just puts you in a deep sleep which is probably like the greatest thing ever because uh, when you are in the deep sleep stages, for those that don't know a lot about sleep, when you're in the deep sleep stages, that's when you get your best like sleep. Also, that's when you get your best dreams. So do me a favor, Mom. Try to remember in your dreams, too, to at least tell the vlog what you dream about in like 15 minutes. Okay. Fun fact, I used to work at this rest stop, and it's kind of sad right now to see it basically knocked down. Fun fact also, there was a basement in that building, so I wonder what they did there, but uh, RIP Sabaros, man. That was uh, not a fun time working there. I don't know if I could film inside or not with my mom's whole surgery going on, so if I can't, well, this is the last time you'll probably see my mom. Mom, it was nice knowing you, we love you. Uh, yeah. Everybody like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell just for my mom herself, but uh, my goal is when she gets out of surgery, which she's all loop de doopy, uh, get her on camera, see if she says anything dumb. I don't know, maybe we'll get something viral with my mom going under anesthesia, but I'm gonna put the camera down, mom. Uh, we love you. Love you. Yeah, have fun. Go, go, bye. bye. See ya. All right, now that that's done, I'm going home. <laughs> bye, mom. Well, I got good news. Surgery was a uh, success. There's my mom. Mom, how you feeling on anesthesia? Fine. <laughs> what, Mom, watch your step. Did you just barp? Barp. Right, wa wa watch your step. I got you. I'll be a good kid and uh, make sure we get you back to your vehicle. So they said everything went well, right? You still have your thumb and all? Yeah. yeah. Ah, okay, that's good. Do you feel loopy doopy at all or? Yes. <laughs> Guys, my mom is completely out of it at the moment. This is a uh, funny, but at the same time, not. I love you, though. I love you. <laughs> Do you know where you parked? Over there. No, that's not your truck. That's not your truck. Your truck's like over there. I need my nose ring back in. Where is it? There, somewhere. <laughs> You okay? Yeah, I'm tired. How many fingers am I holding up? Two. Good. In all honesty, Mom, how was your nap? It's good. I don't remember anything. Do you have like any dreams you remember or no? Nothing. No, I remember going in, laying on the table, putting a blanket on. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I dropped that. Sorry. That was it? That was it. Really? Because uh, you went in at like 10 or something. It is now 12 o'clock. I sat in the back for a while. Ah, uh, okay. Well, speaking of sitting in the back, let's get you up and in into your truck here. Yeah, she really is kind of actually out of it at the moment. How are you feeling now, Mom? I got was hit by a truck. Is that even possible? Yeah. Well, I'm talking about from the anesthesia. Actually, can I, see, can I see your thumb? Does that hurt? Not right now, because it's numb. So, that doesn't hurt? No. Okay, that's good. I have no feeling in my hand. Well, I guess that's a positive, right? That's gonna wrap it up for the video today. If you guys enjoyed it, do me a favor, make sure to drop a like on it, hit that sub button, turn on post notifications, so you never miss out on any uploads here on the channel. I'm gonna get back to a regular upload schedule once again here on the channel. I know I've been slacking. To be honest, guys, I've been live streaming a lot more over on Mixer.com slash SwiftUAV. Uh, we got some big things coming up. 
email right there you guys can't really see uh, but it kind of involves maybe a mixer partnership in the works uh, that'd be very cool uh, once that does happen very very soon so if you guys want to come hang out and uh, watch me live stream on mixer the link will be down below in the video description uh, I'll probably be live tonight around 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time maybe a little bit earlier if I don't do things that I probably should be doing but who no knows? Uh, thank you guys though for watching. Until next time, it's been your boy Jeff, keeping it real. I'm gonna log out. I'm gonna peace out and well. Pa 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 pa. Peace.